Australia's biggest public transport project. The dawn of a new era, transforming how we get around our great global city. Welcome to Sydney Metro. The great engineering marvels of last century, led by visionaries like John Bradfield, have guided our city's growth. And now, a new mass transit system will help shape Sydney into the 21st century, transforming our city with a world-class metro. National engineering experts have named the Sydney Metro Bridge at Rouse Hill Global Project of the Year, beating 23 other projects in 14 countries. Inspired by other major integrated transport projects across the globe, like Hudson Yards in New York and the Crossrail Metro system in London, and rivaling them in engineering excellence with a customer at the centre of everything we do. After eight years of tunnelling, track laying and train building, one of the world's most advanced railways is now successfully in operation. Sydney Metro Northwest opened on the 26th of May 2019. High frequency, reliable and safe trains. Customers don't need a timetable. You just turn up and go. It's another fast option, hopefully, to get to the city or wherever we want to go. It's always good to have an option, and the fact that the trains will run so frequently is really exciting. Now, from the northwest, the extension of Metro is already underway, under Sydney Harbour, through the heart of the city and beyond to Bankstown. Tunnelling has started. The mega borers are back. And this time, there's five. In 2024, Sydney will have 31 metro stations and a new 66-kilometre standalone railway. The first new railway crossing of Sydney Harbour in nearly 100 years. New city stations carefully threaded deep underground with new landmarks above, creating new places and world-scale transport outcomes. The sort of standards in performance, they're definitely global class. The placemaking, the difference we're making to communities, the way we're changing lives, that's definitely a global capability. Linking the past with the future at the iconic Central Station, transforming a century-old station while it's being used by 250,000 people a day will be one of our greatest engineering challenges. And we're just getting started. Construction work starts in 2020 on Sydney Metro West to connect the centre of Sydney with the greater Parramatta area. While a new metro railway will link Western Sydney's new international airport to the rest of the city in 2026. Sydney Metro is Australia's first fully automated metro railway. State-of-the-art operations, fast, safe and reliable driverless trains and Australian-first technology like platform screen doors keeping people and objects like prams safely away from the track. Capacity for a train every two minutes in each direction under the CBD. It's the sort of service that you expect this day and age, so it takes us into that 21st century transport system for Sydney. Every metro station fully accessible for everyone. Level access between platforms and trains and dedicated spaces on trains for those less able, for parents with prams, for luggage and bicycles. Some of the world's best minds have come together to make this transport system a reality. From cutting edge design technology I think that the technology we have used for Sydney Metro is there, in fact, to show our creativity. To complex civil engineering. We didn't have the option to say, sorry, but we don't want the curve. <laughs> and environmentally sustainable solutions. This solar panel installation generates 1,500,000 kilowatt hours of electricity per year. Sydney Metro is nurturing the next generation of engineers, graduates and trainees inspiring people of all ages to shape our future. The structure I've actually been most involved with is building track on the viaduct, or what we call the SkyTrain, and also the ballasted track between both viaducts. The work is very satisfying, I really enjoy it. Much more than a fast and easy way to get around, 
Sydney Metro is a once-in-a-century opportunity realising past legacies like Bradfield's grand transport vision and creating new ones. It opens up employment opportunities, it opens up opportunities for schooling and education. Really excited to the shops as well. They don't have to fight the traffic into Macquarie or even Castle Towers. Really excited about all those sort of options. In future generations, Sydney siders will look back and say, wow, we can't imagine Sydney without a metro system. This is Sydney Metro, the biggest urban rail infrastructure investment in Australian history. For tomorrow's Sydney.